Hello guys, I'm Bhavna Chavla. Welcome to Smart Horizon. In this video, we will learn how to create this explosion box. So here I am using colored pastel sheets, a scale and a pencil. First I will cut a square of 30 cm, 30 by 30 cm. Now with the help of a scissor, I will cut this square out. Now I will draw 9 squares on the sheet each of 10 by 10 centimeters. I will make a square of 10 by 10 cm on a rough paper. Now with the help of a scissor, I will cut this square out. I will fold it in triangle shape like this. What I have to do is I have to make a heart out of it. So I will draw a shape like this as you can see and will cut it with the help of a scissor. So this is our heart shape. We will put it on this corner square and draw the shape as we cut it. In. So now I will remove this paper and I will do the same process for all the corners. Now with the help of a scissor, I will cut all this paper as the shape, the heart shapes, the squares. You can see it on the video. So this is our shape and now we will make crease on the edges with the help of a scale like this. 
we will fold it with my hands. I have to do this for all the four sides. You can even refer to my previous video that is the basic technique of making an explosion box for this. Now I'll fold it like this so that I can convert it into a box. So now this is my box ready. On a different sheet, I will draw a square of 9 by 9 cm for making a smaller heart like I did before. With the help of Ferrigol, I'll paste it like this on all the four corners. This is our result. I will now make a rectangle of 9 cm by 25 cm. I'll mark a point at 8 cm. Again mark second point at 8 cm. So now I have 
three rectangles, two of eight by nine and one of nine by nine. I'll cut it with the help of a scissor now. I have this shape. I'll fold it from the points I have marked. I'll make a crease with the help of a scale. So this is the result that I have got. I will now paste it here with the help of a fevicol. Here you can fold it and see. Now I will make a rectangle of 9 cm by 18 cm and divide it in half. I will now cut it. And will now fold it into half. With the help of a scale, I will make a crease and fold it. I will now paste it on the other side of my box with the help of a favicol. I will now make a rectangle of 9 cm by 25 cm. I will now cut it with the help of a scissor. Now I'll cut three more rectangles, one of 8 by 16 centimeter, second of 7 by 14 and third of 6 by 12 centimeter. I'll fold them into halves. Circle like I have illustrated in the video. This is our output. So for now this part, I'll cut a rectangle of 8 by 8 centimeter and paste it with the help of a fevicol. Now I am having this rectangle of 9 centimeter by 1.5 centimeter and I'll paste it like I have illustrated in the video. So this is my output. So now for the third column, I have a rectangle of 9 by 25 centimeter and four other small rectangles of 9 by 4 centimeters each and a strip of 11 centimeter by 1 centimeter. I'll paste this first rectangle here on one corner. I will put cervical on one corner and paste it just like I have illustrated in the video. Now with the help of a scale, I will mark three points at one one centimeter gap. With the help of a scale, I will make crease 
on the mark points. Fold it properly with the help of your hand. Put fevicol and paste the other three rectangles like I have illustrated in the video. Fold my big rectangle on the other side like this. The way I have illustrated, but first I will cut the extra part of this yellow rectangle. So this is the shape that I have got. I have these four pages. I'll paste this strip on the last paper that I have pasted. I'll paste it the way I am illustrating in the video. I'll now fold this extra strip and paste it with the help of fevicol. I'll put fevicol on the backward side of the strip and paste it to the blue box that I have created. Now I have a square of 12 by 12 centimeter and I'll fold it the way I have illustrated in the video. So this is the shape that I want. I created the other two with the same way that I have created the first one. Now for pasting it, I'll unfold it and paste the second one to one corner of the first one, like the way I have illustrated. I will now paste it on the fourth part with the help of a fevicol. But first I will paste a rectangle of 9 by 9 centimeters and then paste the shape that we have created. So with the help of satin ribbon, I will paste the satin ribbon in such a way that I will be able to tie a knot in front of our shape.
now this is our output this is for first side the second side the third side and the fourth one So now I have folded properly to get a box. So this is our box that we have created. So I'll paste a rectangle of eight by eight centimeter in the middle portion. Now I'll place a basic explosion box in the middle. You can refer to my previous video for the technique. I have uploaded the basic technique of making an explosion box earlier. So this is our basic explosion box. Now I'll make the cap of the box as described earlier in the video of making basic technique of making explosion box. This rectangle is of 10.5 by 10.5 and the corner rectangles are of 3.5 by 3.5 centimeters. I have pasted this small explosion box in the middle of my car. I will place a roll tied with a satin ribbon in this explosion box. This is the message card. This is nothing but a sheet rolled and tied with a satin ribbon. I will put this message roll inside the explosion box, the small explosion box. I will now fold my card, the explosion box, and put the cap over it. Now with the help of a satin ribbon, I will tie a knot like the way I have illustrated it in the video. So this is our final output, this is our explosion box. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, kindly press the like button and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to press the bell icon to get notified when we upload new content. Thank you.